The launch of Artemis 1 makes the SLS the most powerful rocket the US has ever launched, and the majority of the thrust at liftoff comes from those two large, five-segment solid rocket boosters developed by Northrop Grumman. These are an upgrade from the four-segment boosters used on the Space Shuttle, and that now makes them the most powerful solid rocket motors ever flown. In their two minutes of flight, each burns 5.5 tons of propellant per second, generating 1,600 tons of thrust. That means each booster on its own is more powerful than almost any other rocket currently flying. Northrop Grumman has a whole range of solid rocket motors that fit many applications. The Atlas V uses up to five of these in its first stage. The next generation Vulcan will have up to six. But beyond boosters, Northrop Grumman's solid rocket motors propel Antares' second stage and Orion's abort system. When you absolutely need the most thrust, solid rocket motors are the solution. Northrop Grumman's advanced aerospace technology supports many NASA programs such as the ISS, Artemis, the Lunar Gateway, and the James Webb Space Telescope.